important electrical formulas. Engineering is the action of working artfully to bring something about. Engineering is totally based upon theoretical and practical knowledge. Formulas helps us to make the theoretical and practical concepts easier in day-to-day -day practical life. In electrical systems, electrical formulas are used in day-to-day -day life of electrical engineers, electronics engineers and power system engineers. Let's learn some basic and useful electrical formulas, which are also important in view of interviews. Firstly, let's learn about power system. Power system is divided into two systems that is balanced and unbalanced system. The balanced system is one in which the load are equally distributed in all the three phases of the system. Let's understand this using phase or diagram. These are the three phases represented by R, Y and B phases. The magnitude of voltage remains same in all the three phases and it is separated by an angle of 120 degrees. In other words, the phase difference between each phase is 120 degrees. So, the formula for calculate power in three-phase balanced system is Power in watt equals to under root 3 into voltage into current into curse V Where, P is power in watt V is voltage in volts I is current in amperes and curse V is power factor This formula is also used to understand the variation of current when voltages increases or decreases we can easily calculate current in balanced system when voltage, power factor and power is known. So, whenever you are going to analyze a three-phase balanced system, this formulas will always help you. Let's see what is unbalanced system. Unbalance occurs in three-phase power systems when single-phase loads like lighting, office equipment, etc. do not draw the same amount of current on each phase, resulting in greater stress on the neutral conductor and system is said to be unbalanced. The phase or diagram shown is showing an unbalanced power system. Here the magnitude of voltage remains different in all the three phases and it is separated by different angles unlikely balanced system. Let's see the formula to calculate power in three-phase unbalanced system. Here, power is equals to voltage into current into power factor. Here, the value of voltage is 240 volts. So, it's all about balanced and unbalanced power systems calculation. Three-phase squirrel cage induction motors are widely used as industrial drives because they are self-starting, reliable and economical. They are most commonly rated in kilowatt and HP that is horsepower. The old imperial unit horsepower is equal to 746 watts that is 0.745 kilowatt. To convert HP in kilowatts, multiply the 1.341 with the HP value. Power calculation for three-phase induction motor. Power is equals to under root 3 into voltage into current into curse phi A. This method is used theoretically and practically. In industries, it is very much required to calculate full load current of induction motors. The formula for calculating full load current of three-phase induction motor is Full load current is equals to power divided by root 3 voltage into curse phi where power is in kilowatt and current is in amperes but you will find a number of motors in industries and it is not desirable to calculate using this formula so there is a shortcut method which is used to calculate a three-phase induction motors full load current the shortcut formula for calculating full load current of three-phase induction motor is Full load current is equals to power in horsepower multiplied by 1.4 where 1.4 is a multiplication factor. This formula is generally used to calculate the relay range for the motor. But to get a good idea about full load current of a motor, this formula is very useful. Please note an important point, 
When you calculate the current using this formula, you will get some little error in values which are generally in point decimals. This doesn't mean that formula is incorrect. It will give you a good idea of motors for load current. Next comes to DG set load calculations. A diesel generator, also known as diesel genset, is the combination of a diesel engine with an electric generator to generate electrical energy. The formula for calculation of load is KVA into 1000 divided by root 3 into voltage. This formula is also used to calculate the current of three-phase transformer. And the last topic is relationship between phase and line current or voltage in star connected system. This picture is showing star connected source. Here line current is always equals to phase current and line voltage is equals to root 3 times phase voltage. Relationship between phase and line current or voltage in delta connected system. This picture is showing a delta connected source. Here line voltage is always equals to phase voltage. And line current is equals to root 3 times phase current. So, we have covered some important formulas which an electrical engineer uses in day-to-day -day life. We will cover detailed explanation of each topic in separate videos. If you like this video, please like, leave your valuable comments. Subscribe to this channel and share with your friends.